Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Skull the Hero Slayer. <clears throat> I'm Nye. Okay. Let's see. We're going to start with uh, Petty... Th uh, no. no, I'm not going to take a Petty Thief with, with Throw Gold. Thank you. I'm not spending gold to get attacks. We have attacks as it is. Um, okay. So, let's let's get started here. going to be doing my last run of the night, so I'm really hoping that this run will count. So I think the strategy I'm gonna run with, at least for the, uh, at least for the time being, is that very early on in the run, which, you know, we are very early on in the run. So this early in the run, we're going to, that was really stupid damage to take. But this early on in the run, we, we prioritize item rooms and skulls. And then later on in the run, we prioritize money so we can customize. That seems to be the way to go. Um, okay, so uh, incentivizing power skulls. We do uh, our uh, our blessing was to increase damage, uh, both magical and physical, by a fair margin. Actually, as soon as you enter a map for a short period of time. And then, uh, you know, we did obviously just get a pretty huge uh, damage upgrade item. Um, I think we go after the skull. You know, the free item seems really good, but uh, going after the skull allows me... Um, allows me to actually do something with all my... With all my illicit item wealth. You know, we're really looking for something that is a little bit more, um, a little better at cloud or crowd clearing than uh, than little skull here. Uh, okay, and monkey be it. Um, let's go ahead and go for one more upgrade. Then uh, this is a speed skull, so we don't get the we don't get the HP upgrade that the uh, game uh, is offering if we happened to be. A power skull, but the flip side of that is it means that we get to take take advantage of that damage buff by a lot, actually, because of how fast we attack. Now, I was double-checking to see if this was maybe a legendary. It wasn't, uh, and that's fine by me. Magic, extra for Carleone items, and magics. So the game is incentivizing magic. <laughs> Um, I think we're gonna take the uh, take the Cyclops, and we're just gonna move on. Uh, I'm pretty happy with what we have right now. I don't think I'm gonna be making a shift um, at the moment. So that gets me some shields, which is pretty nice. Let's not take that damage. I was trying to see if we could maybe interrupt him the same way we have in the past for um, the archer. Can you stop getting your health back, please? It's really annoying. Okay. What are we offered? Nothing, nothing. Could go for the physical attack, um, which I think is the probably the best option right now, is to go for the physical attack upgrade. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade Stone Monkey. And I think we're going to continue working on our build. Okay, and our damage up uh, for, the, for the room just ended, but that was still a fair amount of... Fair amount of damage, um, really early on there. Ooh, a legendary item. Increase the skill cooldown speed by 120% for 10 seconds every time eight skills are used. Uh, okay. That's, uh, that's pretty hot, I have to say. Unfortunately, not all that hot for Monkey specifically, but maybe that'll change.
Okay, we have just enough money to not be able to pick up anything in here, so we're just going to move straight along. Um, I'm going to go skull-wise. I know money would be nice to have right now, but I think having skulls and maybe getting lucky and getting a big skull um, and being able to maybe, like, make my... Uh, you know, make my dreams come true and get and get tier two monkey or tier three monkey, really. Let's get a get a shield here. But being able to pick up like tier three monkey ASAP would be kind of nice. Uh, not happening there. I don't know. I feel like maybe tier three monkey would be potentially as good as another item. Being able to get my my shadow clones going up and be able to have them auto attack with me, taking down bosses quickly, but also more than that, like the ability to just have a second skill. Hello. Yeah, I don't really actually want that. Um, unfortunately, not gonna be getting uh, the bonus that I just spoke of uh, because we just did not see. Um, we didn't see enough. Uh, bones here. Unless we have a... Yeah, we don't have a rescue here that is uh, bone-oriented. What do we get here? Unfortunately, not much. You know, traps are not going to hurt me as much, but, you know, that doesn't really do anything for me. And then, you know, a magic buff, but we don't really have anything that buffs magic unless I were to switch, you know, switch skulls. Um, obviously, the option to add in a second skull in, you know, play as little skull, something like that. Um definitely there. I didn't realize one of our things gave me that. Oh, I'm just going to take all the damage in the world. Don't you mind me, none. Okay. Just take all the damage in the world. Just so much damage straight to my face. What are you offering me? Explosive arrow. Well, we really don't have anything that triggers explosive arrow, unfortunately. I take that back. Apparently, we have one or two skills that trigger explosive arrow, but nothing, like, nothing huge. Um, I still have three item slots left, so I think items are going to be the way the hero here. I think we are definitely going to be going for... Can you not? I think we're definitely going to be going towards a... Um, skull door. Whatever next skull door I see. Depending. Options... Restoring HP per kills is solid. It's not, like, the skill I would want, but it is a solid skill nonetheless. Why is not the skill that I want? Because ideally, I'm not taking damage, so we're not going to need the health. That would be, you know, that, that would be the ideal of ideals, right? You take no damage, you don't need to restore health. Um, now, whether that, you know, that's not really realistic, honestly, so that's why I'm not really upset about it. money, go to the shop. Um, so that's the Great Warlock. But we only have one magical skill, so I'm not really too terribly worried about it. Uh, they're gonna re-roll, and didn't really end up seeing much, unfortunately. 
Um, I'm gonna pick up Sage's time. It's a little bit of a non-bow, unfortunately. This is the one that has to charge, right? Yeah, it's a concentrate. Okay. Okay, here's our... Here's our skull. It came just in time, so we're gonna be able to upgrade to, uh... You know, to Tier 3 Monkey. We are gonna be able to become Monk. The, the good Monk. Um... Exactly when it's actually relevant to do so. Okay, let's go to Gene, and then let's start getting other stuff. So now that I've done that, now I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty set in order to, um, just kind of continue on. One item slot left before we're going to start going for money, money. Should have taken care of the, the mage, it did. That that attack speed was just sexy. Don't even don't even pretend that you disagree. I'm kinda curious, is this considered to be a skill? It is. Wow. So when I asked why that's considered to be a skill, because that's a skill, it does drop um mechanoid things, which means it, it speeds up my other stuff. A legendary. Successful item attacks increase physical attack by 80% for three seconds. Hot. Okay, so that was a um, very good choice on my part. Oh, I am taking all the damage. Oh, I did not want to do that. Lot of damage taken. It's fine, though. Okay, so no. No. So here's the thing about that. Um, so we're going to take that. We're going to replace the Sphinx Eye. Destroy that. I have some money. Become tier 3 monkey. What skill did I get? Heaven Earth Slam and then Rapid Thrust. Nice. Okay. So I really should not be doing exactly this. Like, I should not be going for an item here. Um, and the reason I should not be going for an item here is that the value out of a random item is no longer quite as good as, like, something else might be. Uh, okay. I'm gonna swap out for explosive arrow because I don't have ranged options. Uh, yeah, I mean, I know it gives me some range stuff, but let's be honest. Let's be honest. Like, it, it's... Yeah, it gives me ranged options, but, um... Should not have taken any of that damage. Money! Okay. No, no, no. Um, uh, let's reroll. Nope, nope, and that is actually really tempting, actually. Is there anything else I'd want to maybe swap out? I still don't know how successful item attack works. Hmm.
You know what? Hit it again. Damn. I was really hoping that we would see something particularly amazing. I mean, the, the Earth Spirit Gnome is good. Don't get me wrong. Earth Spirit Gnome is fantastic. Only problem is, is that while it's good, it's not enough. It's not, it's not big enough, unfortunately. Um... You know what? I think we're going to go for the health, and we're just going to move on. <laughs> now, we haven't seen very many captives lately, either, which kind of surprises me. you attacking me like that rude much um money nah I think we just continue going skulls with the understanding that I need a hundred skulls to get my next upgrade Ah, uh, you had a pocket healer. You still got wrecked. Okay. I I like our build. I like what I'm seeing. Like I I am okay, we got this room as usual. So I'm going to be able to get my health back here. Fight all the way across. Start fighting backwards. You're annoying. I should have been getting all my health back here, but... Okay, there we go. Okay, so we have full health, full the full resources heading into... Uh, heading into the boss. heading into the boss. Why must you always suck? Just gonna wait that out. Why must you guys be staggered? Okay, there we go. Okay, cool. It's not seeing any captives, which is just so bizarre. Money! Okay, 31 skulls going in, so there's a chance that we're going to see tier 4 monkey on the, uh, on the next series of floors, if I get that far. Now, that's the kind of all-important bit here, is am I going to get far enough to see that? I have to be able to beat this boss. I think we're in a reasonable position. Ugh. 
Oh, I should not have taken that damage for any reason, thankfully. Oh, nope, it did not go on shield. Ah, uh, damn. God damn it. Oh, damn. The sister is not anywhere near dead. Which means we're in a very bad position here. Two, one more, three, hit her once, one, two, bullshit begins, do nothing, one, one, two, I'm waiting for my, okay, my quintessence is active, which means I get to hit her, and that gives me a uh, thing, one, two, Bullshit is active. I should have dodged that. One, two, I should have dodged that. One, two, one more. Three, dodge appropriately. One, two, three, dodge appropriately. One, two, she's gonna do bullshit. Dodge appropriately. One, really? One. Two, one more. Oh! She jukes where I thought she was gonna jig. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, I can't, uh, I can't do anything there. Well, I have upgraded my magical attack by, by a bunch. So, magical attack is now fully upgraded. Uh, we have skeleton sword. We're gonna go for one more. I know that's, I know it's a little bit, we're a little bit long in the tooth for this, but, um... Okay, so I really I feel like our magic attack is the one that we need to go for. Let's let him do his thing. Magic? Nope. I am annoyed that that hit me. I am annoyed that happened. It's cool. I'm annoyed by a lot of things. Most of which, you know, let's be fair, is probably the game's fault, but... How did you not die from that? Can you riddle me this, Batman? Okay, come on. Wow. That you can get interrupted. That's okay, I'm just gonna take a bunch of damage for absolutely no reason. Please be something solid. Um nap. Oh come on. God, it's not even a good one. Um I'm gonna take money. Given that, uh, <clears throat> given that we just don't have just a tremendous anything here.
Thank you for doing this right in the middle of my my super thing. Last forever. Skull worth a damn. True. I mean, is it amazing? No, not at all. Is it worth going after? I don't really think so, but is it better than what I had previously? Yes. Um,. Like, I think that's the, the kind of major truth that we have here, is that, um, this, this skull is better than the skull I had previously. That's really kind of all I can say about it. I'm not really excited about what I have here. Oh, uh, you're just not gonna die? Um, nope. I mean, we're just gonna keep on working on skulls, I guess. Ooh, hello. Oh, this skull sucks, though. Oh, god damn it, really? Okay, yep. I, like, falling like that sucks. Um, we're gonna go for another one. See, the funny thing about the Yaksha is that I was just going to recycle it regardless. <sighs> so it's not like I was, you know, like spending all that effort to get something like amazing. I was just going to get rid of it. And like, see, is there a better place that I can potentially get something later? I didn't see... Oh, I have... Okay, I see. I see. That's what my skill is. Not particularly excited about that skill. I get to... If you didn't see what it was, I get to basically do the thing the big tree does, where it shoots out all the, uh... All the green spore orbs. But, again, we got this very slow... Yeah, you know, slow, slow, slow. Um... So I get to do that. I mean, a couple attacks in an AoE is not terrible. It's just not good. Okay, keep on trying. So this is going to be the shop. Get. Nope. And we are still on the lookout for something fantastic. I'm kind of annoyed there's a health down there that I can't get. You guys are both just going over in this direction. Like, I have my preferences on skulls, and some of the skulls that we're seeing are just not good. Like, no. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll take Gene. Uh, you know what? I, I can live with Gene. 
Is he amazing? No, but... So much health. I am annoyed that, that hit me. On the plus side, we might be able to see what a uh, upgraded Gene looks like. Oh, I missed the fact that he was doing another one. That's annoying. Uh, just a war of attrition. I have no damage. Okay, what do we got? God, again. Um, I think we take the attack speed upgrade. Please tell me this is a 10. ever really gone with Gene as an option, so this will be kind of cool. You know, go go with our Genie option. Um, we, we need items. Like, I've, I've gone after non-item stuff too much here. Like, we need to actually get a build going. Love to see more of this. Give me more of attack speed like this, please. Okay, what options have we? I see a thief farmer. Um, let's see, is that a. Uh, might as well, honestly. Give me a quintessence that at least does a thing. Hey, those guys are gonna follow me wherever I go, so I don't really have to base my movements around are they here yet or not. They'll come to me. Or they should at least. Are they not gonna come to me? Oh, now he will. Full health, though. Okay, so we get the skill cooldown speed reduction anyways, even though I didn't choose to buy at the shop. My game is but thou musting me on item selection. Okay, so... Like, we're not in a bad way or anything like that. I just don't feel particularly excited about our build right now. We're knocking at the 15 skulls. Ho I'm probably going to go for, for skulls prior to the next thing. So I can at least try to get it.
annoying. Awesome, got the kill with the swap. I mean, swapping, you know, we're getting there. What do we got? Jack in the box. Okay, so, I mean, we're getting incentivized to swap with our current build, which is not bad. I, I'm not a fan of swap builds, but, you know, I'm not going to argue when the game's like, hey, you know, do a swap build. It's like, okay, well, I can do that. Just becomes a little bit hard to keep track of what's going on when you're doing so much swapping around. Oh my god, can you all stop hitting me, please? Probably should have gone for the item. So we are taking a fair amount of damage off of these damn maids. I don't know why that surprises me. We always take damage off the damn maids. Um, nothing. I need at least 30, so we're going to hit it one more time and hope. I think I took damage for that, too. Okay, got a little bit of health back there. So, you know. Okay, that guy dies. Did not get any health back from that. I mean, we ended up with about as much health as we lost, I suppose. Water skull. Okay. Um, nothing up there. That's exciting. Solar Sword, very exciting. Inner Flame, a little bit less so. Explosive Ointment, we don't care about. Ice Flower, not as good as what I have already. So let's go ahead and just get some health and kind of move right along. Um, I have a build, so I think we're just going to go ahead and start working on uh, money and kind of go from there. Need this to go away. I I really do not particularly appreciate the um I do not particularly appreciate the sick joke. I think I I think it's a particularly bad quintessence. Like I think it's probably one of the worst. If I'm gonna be honest with you. Like on a list of bad quintessences, I think sick joke probably, if not tops the list, is really high on it. I don't know what makes it so bad. Who do I have? Uh, this could be a fine. No. Not doing that. I missed. Okay, we broke. 
concentration. We broke face. Cool. What are our options? So we have some. Ooh, we got some legendary stuff. Ah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So the problem with going gambler. You know what? I take it back. There's absolutely no problems with going gambler. I was actively like looking for okay, what would be a problem with gambler right now? But we don't actually have any real tie to um to physical. We've got some basic stuff going on. Don't get me wrong, but. Like, we're, we're just, we're, we're kind of normal here. Okay, we're not going to actually be doing this guy at all. What we would really like for this guy is the, that, that projectile thing we've seen on a couple of runs where projectiles explode. We're not going to be doing that guy. He's got nothing I want. Um, I have money. Let's start going. Let's get a, uh, an item going. I really do not want to take this much damage. Okay. Item is Fire Spirit Salamander. We can go ahead and replace. I'm going to hold on to Thieves Armor. I think we're going to swap out for Jack in the Box. Okay. So what do we have in here? Uh, okay. Do we have a good Quintessence? No. Okay, we actually have one of the other really not good quintessences. Um, okay, this is what we're going to do. First of all, we're going to grab some health. Um, I'm going to go ahead and re-roll. And I, I was imme I'm immediately rewarded for re-rolling. Uh... Not quite enough to do anything with, but that's actually okay. So right now, the big focus that we're trying to do is we're trying to find um, a quintessence that doesn't suck. Other than that, Gambler is doing fantastically. I'm very excited about Gambler right now. Okay, we have a health upgrade coming. Not a health upgrade, but a health refill, rather. You guys knew what I meant, I'm sure. Not my, not the most exciting of upgrade or of of, of, of rewards here. I think I would have been a little more excited to see uh, to see the prince. Um, but. You know, not a bad thing. Uh, physical and magical attack by 10 is better than standard issue armor. Losing health, and it's annoying. Having a quintessence that was worth a damn would be nice. All 
Okay. I'm not sure how I feel about this boss right now. Um, we like we have some good stuff. We have Gambler in the first place, and Gambler is just really solid. Um, add to the fact that we have some some good magic damage going on. He's got some good skills this time. Uh, I am kind of hopeful about the fight. Um, unfortunately, our quintessence is kind of garbage, and that is the major issue. I really would like her to... Okay, there we go. This is what I'm wanting. Okay. And I would really like the non-hurt sister to be the one that sticks around for a bit. Which is exactly what happened. That's fantastic. Uh, that kind of sucked, and it was all my fault. Oh, if I die. Oh, come on. I got animation locked so hard there. I... We might win. We might win. It's going to be close. Oh, no! I got animation locked! Okay, folks. I'll catch you next time.